During 2018, Samsung released the portable SSD T5, which is a fast credit card sized SSD at just 50 grams and most important it has a USB Type-C port. Since the autumn I'm using this SSD T5 from Samsung to edit all of the videos that you see here on the channel. And today I want to share with you my thoughts of it, so let's get right into it. All the videos that you see on this channel over here have been edited on this MacBook and it is the MacBook Pro 2017 without the touch bar model. It's running the Intel i7 processor with 16 gigs of RAM and with just 256 gigs of storage. And I find that at Apple the storage upgrades are way too overpriced, but with the external SSDs on the rise, the T5 from Samsung was finally an interesting alternative to me. Samsung is extremely successful in the market for internal SSDs, so the step towards external wasn't that difficult I believe. The new T5 series comes in 250 and 500 gigs of storage in either black or steel blue. The 1 and 2 terabyte variants are only in black. One of the many reasons why I do like the Samsung SSD T5 is because there is a USB Type-C to Type-C cable and that makes perfectly sense on a laptop that has only Type-C ports. They also offer hardware based AIS encryption which is good enough for most consumers and it's also compatible with Android, Mac and Windows. The most important reason why I do like the Samsung SSD T5 and I have the 500 gigs model is because of the reading and writing speed. And in my daily usage I get around 400 MB per second for reading and writing. Now that is first of all extremely useful when you want to transfer 4K video files because it goes in no time. And secondly it is great for editing because it allows me to edit straight away from the SSD itself. And as you can see what formats here is supported and it, and it can handle in terms of data speed transmission, it is pretty impressive. Even 4K video in RAW could be edited right away from the SSD itself. When you use benchmarking tools for synthetic tests for the reading and writing speeds, it goes even higher, albeit that it will most likely never happen during normal day-to-day -day tasks. On top of that, if they didn't use the SATA 600 internally, the scores could have been even higher. The T5 SSD from Samsung is more expensive than the traditional external hard disk that you might know, but it's so much faster, it is so much smaller and it is more convenient to bring along with you that it outweighs the cost. It is approximately 25 euro cents per gigabyte or let's say 30 dollar cents per gigabyte, which is very acceptable at the time of uploading this video. Now if you have some questions, comments or remarks, let me know in the comment section down below. For me this is so useful that I love to use this perk because I can edit on the go on any kind of laptop or computer let's say. Thank you so much for watching this video, let me know what you think in the comment section. Don't forget to give it a like, subscribe if you haven't already and then I hope to see all of you in the next one.